Hey there everybody, this is Chuck Wilson and today I want to do a tutorial on the spline tool in the graphite modeling toolbar. So I've got this character here and let's check and make sure that yeah it needs to be to an editable poly. So here's our jacket. I'm going to zoom in a little here and I'm going to turn off the wireframe on it. So we still have it selected and I'm going to go up here and I'm in free form. And I'm going to pick on surface and then I'm going to click this to pick and we'll pick the jacket. I don't know it says default zero but it's the jacket. And now we will click on the splines. And this tool is really cool. I had to do a video on it because I've overlooked this a bunch. So start anywhere and just hold down your left click button and you can drag and this will lay a spline right on that surface perfectly. Then you unclick and you select the spline and then we can go over here to rendering of course and enable and just look at that. That is awesome. Man, I wish I would have known about that a long time ago. But, it's pretty sweet and I wanted to do a video on it. Now, there were some problems with it. Um, let's delete that out of there. We'll go back we'll select the jacket again. Now, if I click splines, I'm pretty sure, yeah, see? It's not letting me draw a spline on there. And this is probably why I never because it was bugged on me and I couldn't tell so r right now it should draw a spline but it ain't so what you gotta do is you gotta click shapes and then splines and now it'll draw a spline again I don't know I think it's a bug now here's another bug too so if we draw a spline and you have got bad habits like me and you naturally hit control Z because you don't want that spline control Z wait a minute the spline's still there okay so let's unselect spline and now see we can't we can't select that spline at all it won't let us select it's like it's not there or something's goofy if we get the layer explorer out and um well here it is shape down here here this is it Okay, so I just clicked it, and now look, it totally disappeared. <clears throat> I, I don't even know where it went. There's nothing there, though, I can tell you that. So, and then uh, if I hit delete, it's gone, I guess, or wherever. So, yeah, very buggy, but very cool at the same time. So back here we'll hit splines and of course it's not going to draw a spline it's broken at the moment so you got to hit shapes and then splines now you can draw a spline again unclick that you can select it and then enable in, in viewport and yeah and it works on everything it's slick I like it all right you guys have a good one got any questions post them in the comments Okay, catch you next time.